My First Chinese New Year by Karen Katz. Hooray, hooray, soon it will be Chinese New Year. First, we decorate the walls with cut papers, all red and bright. Red means good luck and happiness in China. My sister and I sweep away the bad luck from last year. Now we are ready to welcome in good luck for the new year. Dad and I buy plum and quince blossoms. The tiny buds remind us that new things can always grow. Grandpa and I make an altar to honor our ancestors. We add bowls filled with tangerines and oranges. They stand for money and good luck. Now we need to start cooking for our New Year's Eve banquet. It takes a lot of work, so we start a few days early. Grandma and I make a special soup to bring good health. Later, I will fold the dumplings with my cousin. On New Year's Eve, grandparents and cousins and aunts and uncles come over to share our feast. We all sit at a big round table. We have our special soup, chicken, whole fish, and for dessert, eight precious rice pudding. Delicious. On New Year's Day, Grandpa, Grandma, Mom, and Dad give us money in little red envelopes. This will bring us more good luck. At last, it is time for the Chinese New Year's Parade. Here comes the lion dancers. Look how beautiful they are. The lion's mouth is open and his ears are wiggling. He gobbles up green lettuce and red envelopes. I hear drummers beating and cymbals clashing. I see floats and paper lanterns. Finally, at the end of the parade, the dragon. It is a sign of good luck and the beginning of spring. We hug and we wish each other Gong Hei Fat Choi Happy New Year!